726, you are clear for takeoff. Roger that. 27, hold Redcon 1 at base. Roger, good copy. We're crossing the fence. Stay alert. Alabama, Alabama. Music scene TV. shows area. Keita Boston. We sure appreciate her too, don't we? Yeah. Man, I wish I was on that boat there. Today, we have Blind Ambition playing at a Customer Appreciation Day up there on 79 Highway. We got lots of bluegrass from the May 2nd Festival. Be right back, y'all. Campbell's Pharmacy. Great customer service. No long waits on drug orders. Campbell's has competitive prices. Same friendly staff each visit. Campbell's takes the majority of third-party insurance plans. Campbell's Pharmacy in Adamsville. Hours 8.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Friday. 8.30 a.m. to 2 p.m. Saturday. Closed on Sunday. Call 205-674-3566. Here's a bluegrass jam from the Bluegrass Festival, May the 2nd.
was a fantastic day, had lots of people having fun. Now for Mel's Customer Appreciation Day, here's Blind Ambition. This is a friend. Yeah, I know it's been a good friend of mine. Lately something's changed, they hard to define. Just got himself a girl and I want to make her mine. Midnight Special, downtown Jasper, Alabama. Friendly bartenders and staff, darts and food. Wednesday, karaoke. Thursday, open mic with Zach Baker. Friday and Saturday, karaoke. Sunday, four to eight, the band. Karaoke afterwards. Hours, Monday through Thursday, one o'clock to whenever. Friday through Saturday, 11 to whenever. Sunday, noon to whenever. Midnight Special in Jasper. Midnight Special open seven days a week, y'all. Do you love good bluegrass? Well, do you? We have some right here on AMS TV. Here's Crossing Grass. <laughs>
don't forget now, Steve has one ten air conditioners down there. It's getting hot weather. I need to go check him out. Here's some more bluegrass for you. Valley Road. I was born in the valley so many years ago. Before the streets were house to house, all within a stone's throw. Fields full of corn and cotton, see the sunrise as you go. Down that long and narrow dirt trail, we call the valley road. Joe, and you're watching Alabama Music Scene. Thank you, Mary Joe. What do you get when you play country music backwards? You get your job and your wife back. Oh, no. what 
we do. I started this show to show the public what musicians, bands, and songwriters go through. So get out there and support these guys and gals, y'all. Now here for the video of the week, it's all about that bass, y'all. Would you believe bass frequencies can put out fire? Here we go, video of the week. We're both graduating from the Electrical and Computer Engineering Department at George Mason University uh, this coming May. Uh, we're here, we're just gonna test out our, our device that we use that uses sound frequencies to extinguish flames. I, I see this device being applied to a lot of things. First off, I think in the kitchen, it could be on top of a stove top, um, but eventually I'd like to see this applied to maybe swarm robotics where it'd be attached to a drone and that would be applied to forest fires or even building fires where you wouldn't want to sacrifice uh, human life. Our professor Brian Mark really stepped in to help us. He just gave us a lot of support. I think as a whole, engineering is, is really just finding solutions to, to comp you know, finding simple solutions to complicated problems. You know, engineering is all about finding a way to make the impossible possible, so that's what we did. Say Reeves Speedway, the South Action Track, celebrating 40 years of racing. Open wheel modified, sportsman, mini modified, street stock, modified light, buzz and renegade. Pit gates open at four, practice at six, qualifying at seven, and racing starts at 8 p.m. Located out Highway 78 West, mile marker 151. For track information, call 205-648-2041. The South Action Track, here's another jam session from the festival. Slowly the long day turns to night, and soon as we join. Stay right there for the picture of the week. Hey, Triple L, all sales and thrill. Clothing, pick five at one dollar each. CDs, DVDs, VHS tapes, pick five at one dollar each. Furniture, appliances, electronics, tools, cars, trucks, and trailers. A gaming shop, small engine repair, vapors for you. Carlos Creations, flavors and equipment. In Sullivan, across from Sonic and the big chain link fence. Call 205 353 6500. Don't forget now, Steve has 110 air conditioners down there. It's getting hot weather. Need to go check him out. Here's some more bluegrass for you Valley Road. Thank you. 
lights and city nights. Think about most any place the man fear to die. Every now there's a lady who can't turn back the miles. Gentle as the summer morning air. Traveling down the blue road. Wondering hard and waiting just to get back home again. Winds are blowing down the blue road. Too long to lose her. Soon he's gone away. I took a lot of pictures at the Bluegrass Festival May the 2nd, and here are some of them for the Picks of the Week. Another show in the books. Listen, the Bluegrass Festival, May the 2nd, was a big success. It was a beautiful day that day. Everybody had a good time. And I want to thank my new correspondent from the Muscle Shoals area, Keita Boston. She's going to be sending me videos of people playing up there and uh, information. And uh, I sure appreciate it, Keita Boston. Mm, love you, girl. And... Uh, Go by and see my wonderful sponsors. You wouldn't be you wouldn't be watching me right now if it wasn't for my sponsors. Lee's Family Restaurant and Dinner Theater right there in Summerton. A Triple L All Sales and Thrift in Summerton. Steve's Pawn Shop across the road from Pinnacle Bank in Summerton. Uh, Campbell's Pharmacy. They're in Adamsville, Alabama. Campbell's Pharmacy. Say Reese Speedway, go up 78, mile marker 151, follow the signs there. M uh, Midnight Special, they're in downtown Jasper. My wonderful sponsors, call them and let them know you saw them right here on Alabama Music Scene TV, y'all. And uh, I want to thank my guest on the show today, Mary Jo, Mary Lin Lindley, and Jaden Fowler. You know, Jaden used to help me out on... AMS TV, and uh, there's a little girl, 11 years old, I, I can't remember her name, but y'all saw her, a uh, little girl, a little dark-headed girl there, I want to thank every one of them, they helped me out, because uh, Joanna, she'll be back next week, 
she's out on assignment doing what she needs to do, y'all. So uh, y'all be careful, and uh, we're going to roll them credits now. Now, pay attention to these credits, okay? Might be telling you something. Watch next week. Got a, got a good 50s and 60s show coming your way, and I guarantee some special stuff on it.